the Mountain West. Boy, you talk about fun. Fresno State heading to Boise State, and the Mountain West Conference Championship game has a line of three in favor of the Broncos here. The total sits at 54. Of course, the latest numbers at BetUS. The total, not excuse me, the total, the time is 4 p.m. Eastern time, and this one's going to be on Fox. Now, I'm going to pull up these stats, but I I want to make something perfectly clear here. Uh, We can look at this Boise State defense all day, right? Number 14 uh, PPA per drive on defense. They, You look at what they're able to do as far as uh, uh, the passing game is concerned. Number seven in PPA per pass. Uh, Number three in passing success rate allowed. And here's here's the issue. Let's go, let's look at uh, CFB stats. All right, that'll be the best place. All right, CFB stats has, da, 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 da. we'll pull it up like that. I know this is great radio and I apologize, but regardless, um, how about this? I'll cut this out of the segment later. <laughs> uh, I need total offense and, all right, here we go. Here's what they have faced on defense. Utah State, Wyoming, Nevada. They lost to BYU, who is the best quarterback that they faced, and that's my point. Colorado State, Air Force, Fresno, uh, and that was with Logan Fife at quarterback, not Jake Hayner. San Diego State, UTEP, Tennessee Martin, New Mexico, and Oregon State, where they got absolutely throttled um, in the first game of the season. I think, I think that Boise has not faced a team like Fresno with a quarterback like that this year. That's the biggest issue, is that they haven't seen anything like this. So while while the numbers over the past five weeks would show that Boise stood, should be favored by about a touchdown, they didn't have to face Hayner the first time. I know that they're going to be at home. I know that Taylor Green is absolutely ridiculous. But you start looking at some of these numbers. Uh, Fresno, number 44 in defensive PPA per drive over the last five weeks. Uh, they're able to stop some of the things that, that Boise does uh, really, really well, right? Um, as far as the running game is concerned, Fresno, number 25 in rushing success rate allowed. Uh, what I don't like is that rushing explosiveness. Like, this thing could turn sideways quickly um, if they give up big runs to Taylor Green. That's certainly not uh, ideal for sure. But I think that Fresno is going to be able to put up points here. Like, I think that Fresno is uh, absolutely going to score points, and I'm just wondering if Boise State is going to be able to keep up with them. Uh, because we saw BYU just go up and down the field on this defense. I think that might be what we're going to run into again. There's not a stat that can point it out, but that's that's what I'm seeing from this defense. I like Hayner. I like this offense. Uh, Give me Fresno plus the three on the road at Boise State. Uh, I will take Jeff Tedford in this spot. Uh, I think he's got a coaching advantage over Andy Avalos right here. Uh, I like Tedford quite a bit. So give me Fresno plus the three. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app and make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.